Abu Muhammad al adnani the man who orchestrated the Islamic State group's attacks abroad, was officially declared dead by the jihadist news agency on Tuesday. Reports suggest that Adnani had been killed while overseeing operations in Aleppo. Washington has yet to confirm his death, but it did announce that a U.S. airstrike had targeted Adnani in the Syrian city of Al-Bab, northeast of Aleppo. The loss of the jihadist group's mouthpiece would mark a significant blow to the militants. Although he's been described as a spokesperson, he was actually much more than that. He was one of the Islamic State's most senior people in Syria, widely thought of as being a kind of propaganda chief, a military planner, as well as an excellent orator. Some have even thought of him as being a kind of the, kind of the group's second in command after Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi, the head of the Islamic State. After the 2003 U.S.-led invasion of Iraq, Adnani joined al-Qaeda in Iraq, the precursor to the Islamic State group. He gained notoriety in 2014 after declaring a self-styled Islamic caliphate stretching across Syria and Iraq. Adnani published recordings online inciting supporters to kill Western targets with stones, knives or vehicles, whatever weapons were at their disposal. Earlier this year, he called for massive attacks during Ramadan. It ended up being the bloodiest Muslim holy month in recent memory. Islamic State group supporters have launched attacks in France, Belgium, Germany and Turkey, amongst others.